Hey everyone, welcome to Mr. Riley Reads. I am Mr. Riley, and today I have another wonderful story that I would like to read uh, to you. It's entitled The Adventures of Gary and Harry, The Tale of Two Turtles. So let's swim our way into it, shall we? The Adventures of Gary and Harry, A Tale of Two Turtles. Story by Lisa Matamoso, illustrated by Michael Firiwa. Deep in the sparkling sea, Gary, the green sea turtle, and his best friend, Harry, the hark-billed turtle, played in their ocean home. Each day, they would swim to the surface and happily dive beneath the waves. Gary and Harry loved their carefree life in the sea and liked to visit their many ocean friends like Olivia the octopus, Lori the lobster, and even Herman the grumpy old hermit crab who was really nothing but a big softy under that crusty old shell. For Gary and Harry, each day was a great underwater adventure. Some days they would explore deep into dark underwater caverns. Other days they would search for long lost treasure buried deep in the hulls of old sunken ships. When they wanted a good laugh, they would visit the crazy clown fishes who performed in Harold's Harlequin Shrimp Spectacular Sea Circus. One day after their morning adventure, Gary and Harry were especially hungry. As always, it was difficult deciding what to have for lunch since they had very different tastes in food. How about a salty seaweed salad made of fresh algae, Gary suggested. Algae? Yuck, Harry replied, making a face. I'd rather have a nice, tasty jellyfish. His wish had been answered, for suddenly a school of jellyfish floated by. Wow, look at all those jellyfish. Harry quickly swam to the largest one and swallowed it in one big gulp. Gary expected to hear a satisfied ah, but instead Harry responded with a terrified ah. <coughs> Harry was gasping and choking. That was no jellyfish he had swallowed. It was a plastic bag. Harry knew many sea turtles had died from choking on plastic bags, but he never once thought it would happen to him. Harry desperately tried everything to remove the plastic bag, but it just wouldn't come out. His life flashed right before him. Luckily, Gary had just completed his turtle safety class and by using the Heimlich maneuver, the plastic bag flew right out of Harry's throat. Whew. That was close, Harry said while catching his breath. How did a plastic bag get in the ocean anyway? How else, Gary answered, the humans. Well, they need to be more careful to keep their trash out of our homes. Harry said angrily. Gary couldn't agree with him more. Suddenly, Harry's stomach rumbled. All the excitement worked up his appetite. Well, I'm starving, he told Gary. Let's get lunch. Just then, a beautiful jellyfish floated by. Look, Harry, just what you asked for lunch. After what Harry had been through, suddenly, Jellyfish didn't seem too appealing. Maybe I'll try one of those salty seaweed salads. Gary's face quickly lit up. Well, I know the perfect place to go, he said excitedly. And with a flick of their flippers, they quickly dove through the crystal blue waters, eager to enjoy a nice, delicious, relaxing lunch. The end. Hey everyone, so that was the story of The Adventures of Gary and Harry, uh, A Tale of Two Sea Turtles. Hopefully you enjoyed listening and watching uh, this particular story. 
And do me a favor, if you found value in this particular story, go ahead, like, leave a comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. That way you will be notified anytime I drop a brand new video or story. And let's do what we can to reduce, reuse, and cycle, so that way we will not harm any of the animals in the ocean. And so with that, continue to be safe, and I'll see you in the next video.